hello everyone so today also we are going to continue with the menu system we are going to look into this control remapping so last time we had few issues with the control remapping system and this controls basically displaying it without a scroll bar so today we are going to add a scrollable pane so even though we have menu input uh, menu controls we only see we see them properly with this scrolling ability and also now we are going to fix the remapping today so for example if i want to use enter for jumping rather than space let me apply now it is working last time it was not working so if i go back and reset now it's working with the space so yeah that's basically what we are going to do today all right so this is where we stopped last time we created everything for the menu system and when we go to controls we have a long list of controls without having ability to scroll and if i want to change something when i press here even if i press any key nothing happens so those are the things that we need to solve today right so first uh, i'll go to menu system ui widget controls so here this is automatically populated so that's why we already get the full list so instead of having it like this we need to show those controls inside a scrollable scroll pane basically so key panel so in order to have a scrollable area we need to have This is scroll box so I think if I replace this key panel with the scroll box this should work yeah oh hmm. right so here actually this used to be a vertical box but now it's a scroll box but still can we use add child here yeah, we can okay now let's check settings controls we have the scrollable pane but it's working but we need to basically um, reduce the area so how is it designed here so the keys appear those back key and everything uh, they are coming from mm -hmm. which one here widget options they are in this horizontal box one hundred and fifty units up from the bottom bottom so here if i move it completely here and offset from bottom 
let's give 150 where no not 100, 150 we need to compensate for this with the cell which is 50 so I think 250 should work yeah nice so now we can see all the controls properly next thing is when I press one of them we need to press any key and that should be assigned here but that part is not working because in the in here in menu player control I think I had uh, any key event this one so this event is not implemented in code like me player controller so let me just copy this here ALS player controller okay now it should work wait oh we don't have a widget control variable let's create it right but that's not enough where else are we reference in this register key change so we need to have this one this event also but this is implemented through BPI PC menu so player controller menu did I implement that here no so let's add it PPI PC menu okay now this works all right now let's check settings controls instead of jump let's try to use n okay apply okay see you. doesn't seem to work see but the key change was registered and now it's working all right I think I know what caused that because I remember we had to do something like rebuild control so something like that Yeah, we need to do that this one refresh key mapping we need to implement this function also in our ls player controller where is refresh key mapping it's not implemented here Oh, I think it's here. Yeah. Because uh, this was 
this uh, this is ls pen player controller here we don't have it because this is just the player controller that i had used in the menu level main menu level so they actually we didn't have a character so i had not implemented this one but this is cla map player controller this is where i actually had a character so here i had to refresh this otherwise the input change will not effect until we restart the game so yeah can copy this into a ls player controller and it should work now at the moment i can jump with n now if i go to post menu controls jump if I press the space and apply now the changes are after, uh, in effect without restarting cool. all right so that's all I wanted to do in this episode so thanks for watching as always project files will be available for the download in the patron page link would be in the description below and if you like to support my work you can get the membership of the patron club see you in another episode goodbye